Ah, such magnificent artwork. It is quite remarkable. Whoa, Dave! Uh, it is not Dave. What? Whoa! <laughs> it looks like Dave's gonna need a new variant. Welcome back to Believers Elite Legend back at you guys with another Marvel Legends video and before the Elite Legend undresses the elephant in the room in regards to Hasbro's recent price hikes and their stunning and brave new packaging the Elite Legend has to show off a haul from Marvel Legends. <laughs> Hi, Elite Legend. I just love unboxing with you. All right, Marsha. Thanks for opening the box. Get back down there. The first thing we're going to open it up, it is from Target, the Elite Legend. They tell you to expect more, pay less. But when you order something from Target, you never know if it's the item that you actually ordered. We're going to take that receipt and we're going to tear it up. And it is exactly what the Elite Legend ordered. And lately, Marvel has turned my world upside down. And it's no different. This Doctor Strange needs to be turned the right way. And we're going to go ahead and take a look at this figure right now. And he is staring a soul into my heart. And look at that Doctor Strange mullet. But here you see, Doctor Strange is Earth's foremost magical defender, safeguarding our dimension against the supernatural threat of price hikes and plastic-free packaging from the good folks at Hasbro. Stop doing that! Now, the Elite Legend says it time and again. I am not an MCU collector, but I am an action figure addict, and I wanted this figure for just one thing. And we're going to get to it in just a second. But there you see the Multiverse of Madness Doctor Strange in his red and black attire, which apparently will be featured in the movie dropping in May. So without further ado, let's reach inside of this box and pull this figure out. And oh, that's very fancy plastic. Wow. This plastic is like the McRib and McDonald's. It is only going to be around for a limited time, so enjoy it while it lasts. Here is the inside. The Elite Legend likes this. This is pretty cool. I'm going to use this um, potentially for some ACBA. And here we have some more instructions. I don't need those. And it wouldn't be an Elite Legend video if we weren't doing the sweet sounds of release. So let's go ahead and do that. <laughs> Strange. Now, Dr. Strange comes with two additional hands, but they are not a match. One is for the Kung Fu grip to do this, and the other one is a fist. So, no double fisting action for Doctor Strange. Ha 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 ha! I am not alone! Now, yes, the Elite Legend is an addict for the plastic and a sucker to boot. I paid 30 bucks for this flaming hole. Let them baby, while I have wand and dined with King and Queen, I've clapped an Aladdin down on Poke and Bean. And I'm not too proud to admit that there was a time or two where I paid a little bit more for a little bit of flaming hole, baby. Whoa, did Dusty just disappear? Wow, this Doctor Strange figure has incredible detail. Look at this paint. Look at the sculpting. This is sick. Somebody at Hasbro doesn't know anatomy, though. Um, he does look a bit like a wimp, but I guess that's cool because Doctor Strange doesn't lift. But look at this impressive I thought it was a mullet. I thought at first it was a mullet, but it's not. It's a kind of like a master splinter ponytail. But again, look at the sculpting here. Clean red paint throughout. This skirt is going to hinder his movement. So let's take a look at the articulation while we can. So his head will go up and down. He has this diaphragm that will let him spin all the way around. And you can also rotate at the waist. He will rotate up that much, go up that pretty far. Wow, look at that. He has a bicep swivel. He has the double-jointed elbows. Let's see if we can get those to work pretty well. Um, also, pinless. For you pinless freaks out there, we're paying $27.99 for a Marvel Legend figure because of that useless tooling there he has a hinge rotation at the wrist and again there you can see he has the double shocker 
Wow. He cannot do a Jean-Claude Van Strange again because he is hindered at the little skirt. He can kick up that much on this side, that much on the other side. He has rotation above. Actually, he has it at the thigh. Um, he has the double jointed knees. He has boot rotation. He has a hinge and rocker. So, And he doesn't have little baby feet, so that's good. So, incredible articulation. But this figure, for the Elite Legend, great articulation, great sculpting, great paint. I'm not an MCU guy, so let's uh, <laughs> do some comparisons. And unfortunately, when I articulated his skirt, the paint started to chip, so you might want to be careful with that. If you're old school and you still get down with Toy Biz, here is the new MCU Strange alongside of the Toy Biz OG. And here he is alongside of the Rentra Build-A-Figure Wave Astroform Doctor Strange. And here is Doctor Strange flanked by the Sorcerer Supreme Wong, the most electrifying man in the MCU, and Meth Macau Mordo on the right. And unfortunately, you don't see the morning breath of superheroes, America Chavez, because unfortunately, she got stuck in the trash compactor. So um, there you see Doctor Strange all by his lonesome. No America Chavez. And here we see him alongside of the levitating Doctor Strange. Nice scud. Whoa, what's going on? What's something strange is going on here? Whoa! Wow! That was amazing! And we got three Walmart bags in front of us, and I kind of see the Thor Woke Thunder logo inside of there. So let's go ahead and take a look at what's inside of the first bag. And we have... We have Groot! This is the Thor Love and Thunder Wave. This is Groot from Guardians of the Galaxy, and he comes with a torso to build LGBTQ Korg. Awesome! And, of course, we have Peter Quill looking a lot like his daddy, Ego. <laughs> Look at this. He comes with one of the arms for Korg and two blasters. And how about a little bit of Ravager action? We have the Thor in his Ravager attire. Remember when everybody was saying that these were... Um, Street dated. Um, they were also saying that they are a recall because of the paint. But then they start showing up mysteriously at the doorsteps of prominent um, YouTubers because Hasbro, they're geniuses and they want to control narratives and they want to build excitement for a wave that really isn't all that exciting. But this figure is incredible. Comes with a Stormbreaker and Thor in Ravenger gear. Now let's go and take a look inside of the other bag. And oh my god, back from his excellent adventure, he wants you all to know that it's important to be excellent to each other. This is a this is actually death from Bill and Ted's excellent adventure. Um was he in Bogus Journey? I don't know, but this um depiction of <laughs> Gore the God Butcher is Pretty, did I say Bookshire? The linguistics majors are going to come for the Elite Legend. I'm surprised they haven't already. But this is Gore the God Butcher. And he comes with one of the legs for Korg. Why do you want to kill me? I don't want to kill you. I want to display you, buddy. So we got Gore the God Butcher. That means we have Thor! And it is not the mighty variety. He comes with Stormbreaker. He comes with an additional fist. And a very shiny attire. This is very reminiscent of how Odin used to look back in the day in the comics. Um, but this is very nice. Probably the best looking figure of the wave. And, but this is the main event. This is what everybody is going to be watching that movie to see. King Valkyrie. Oh my god. This is amazing. This is stunning. This is brave. She comes with... Korg and his little bat. She comes with a little blade of dagger. I don't know what it's called. Let me know in the comments. What is her blade called? I'm surprised it's not double-edged, but this is nice. And, oh my, the main event of the evening. Oh my god. It is. And it's not... She's not the female Thor. 
She's not the girl Thor. She's Jane Foster Thor, a.k.a. Mighty Thor. So we got Thor, but this is the Mighty Thor. She wields the hammer, Molnir, the Uru hammer. If you're old school like the Elite Legend, has two additional heads. But she comes with the leg to build Korg. And there you see Korg in all of his glory. And leave it to Hasbro. Price hikes. $24.99 for a Marvel Legend action figure. And you're getting a repainted figure from a two-pack that nobody wanted from the Ragnarok wave. Are you excited about Thor? Mighty Thor? Gore? <laughs> King Valkyrie? Ravenger Thor? Star-Lord? Or Groot? Let me know in the comments. <laughs> so what an incredible haul. We got the... Target exclusive Doctor Strange, and we have the entire Thor build a figure wave. Holy shit! Is it another variant of Dave? This is no variant, Elite Legend. This is Dave from Asgard. And soon, <laughs> your collecting days will come to an end due to the price hikes and distribution chaos. <laughs> Doctor Strange, you're back. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you haven't already done so, hit that subscribe button. Hit the notification bell so you can be alerted to all of Elite Legends' next videos. I drop content regularly, so you don't want to miss that. Check out my Marvel Legends playlist. G.I. Joe Classified Series playlist. Thrift Hall playlist. I tell you guys time and again, I found a McFarlane Spider-Man in the wild. Follow the Elite Legend on Instagram at Elite Legend 224 I started a toy group called Elite Toy Collectors on Facebook. So join the fam there. And until next time, make mine Marvel.